Today I will show you how to replace this bushing from a control arm bushing. It, it should be. Uh, and um, I will show you how to do it and how does it look like when this bushing is done. Um, I draw with this problem about um, two more two, five six months and I, 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 I don't I didn't know what what's going on and when I came to do the alignment the guys told me that I have very bad torrent uh, pushing yeah, it should be it shouldn't be like that so guys I am working with the fingers and Uh, this bolt you need to use long wrench Ooh. and it work or impact gun but you don't have access here to do that and uh, I bought extension like long. I bought very long uh, range. Yeah, first you need to unscrew a little bit to loose, and then you can continue with your regular range. also is bad completely torn and not completely but very very bad condition and uh, uh, of course I need to replace it but it should be solid it, you can if you take brand new you, you don't you, you you are not able to move this rubber center yeah I have to replace because it's hundred percent not working properly millimeter millimeters yeah okay we tie this thing and I do this second side okay finished then I use marker paint marker to mark area where it should stop. Okay. <laughs> okay. It 
should be enough. Center. I need a center. I do the pushing. mark the bushing here also because I need center here other side also See your market, yeah. Here you can see the damage. This bushing is torn. It's not. I can move with the finger. It shouldn't be like that. And yeah, I just marked. The press the bushing from from uh, center to the outside, uh, and I will also install the bushing back, new bushing, from inside the car to the out. It means. I need to align here. I need to align the bushing here. Right here. Should help me. This is a difficult job, very difficult, and uh, I will try to do that. One of my battery died, and uh, for the impact gun, and sure if I am able to do that but we'll see okay. it goes but slowly it goes No, it's so difficult to find uh, proper tools for this job, but because it's expensive.
First of, uh, first of all, I want to say that um, this this uh, this side of the bushing should go uh, to the back side of the car. As you can see, here is one pin. Like it 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 showed us the direction that it go. It should go to the back side of the car. And also, don't buy any Chinese uh, bushing. I already bought one one, and it, it is very very bad. Because first, first thing that here is, as you can see, this the bushing is uh, the range range is uh, a little bit bent, like uh, more uh, smaller. It is special, special. Uh, they did it specially for installation, and I will show you what I mean. If you install this bushing. You can just, of course, we have these marks. Yeah, we have these marks. I will, I will do it more, a bit longer. Okay, like that. Yeah, guys. Uh, first thing is that line this bushing to this line, and just press it with the hand. And as you can see, it already it holds. As you can see, guys, it holds. It's there. But if you will buy Chinese, the installation will much much more and more difficult and you can completely destroy the, the arm. My suggestion is uh, not to buy, don't buy Chinese oh. Chinese bushing. This is from 7 series. The 5 series has different bushing. Although the suspension is very similar.
<laughs> I need more, little bit more. Actually, I hate this fork. I told you guys, it's pain. I stopped. Stop going inside. It's almost there. I moved a little bit back, half millimeter back. Now everything is fine. Probably half millimeter. Yeah. Half millimeter, I have to push a little bit this side, half millimeter in. I moved, uh, I installed the bolt, I just a little bit press this, a little bit uh, pull this, uh, this arm, too much the bolt, and now I have to screw this, screw this bolt in back, 20 millimeters E, and will be and after that I will not uh, screw completely this bolt in I will uh, I will uh, I will drop car down and tighten the bolt because uh, when you're tightening this bolt the car shouldn't be in, in, in air it should be on the ground You can see the car is on uh, back to the ground and I have here access to tight this bolt and after that I will I will I will leave the car back and I will tight with this long long wrench I am tightening the, this bolt because it's so important that this car should be to, on the ground. Okay. Okay, guys. Very important step. The last step should be uh, this, guys. The car is again on the air, and uh, yeah, guys, it's very important, very important to tie this bolt with the long range because if you will tie it with with the short, it is loose and it, the the bushing the bushings will in short time break. And now I am tightening, yeah, guys, as you can see, I'm, I did one turn. Okay. Okay. It's 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 it. It's completely. Of course, I didn't over tight. I feel it when the bolt stopped, and that's it, the guys. This bushing is installed properly, and I'm happy about because second also was installed here. And uh, probably well, next step will be replacing this bushing, this bushing, and this bushing. It also could be bad. I bought already, 
one of them and yeah but guys this bushing is the most important bushing in whole suspension or I still learning English and this process is not so easy because I have to learn a lot of new words thousands of words and sorry guys I hope in in one year I will speak much much better than now sorry guys